I made it. Morthal. Hello guys, this is the Hexagon Zero, and welcome back to another episode of Skyrim. Dun 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 dun. Alrighty then, I said that we had to have an object, and that object was to get to Morthal. And we made it. And I... I can't exactly remember why I wanted to get to Morthal in the first place, but I know it was something to do with finding another quest, because I'm kind of running dry on the quest-ish place, and I'm also avoiding having to do um, uh, the main storyline quests, because those, uh, those can be over rather quickly. Whoa, lag, 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 lag. Normally my Skyrim doesn't drop below 20, it was hitting 10 there. That's weird. This isn't Assassin's Creed 4. <gasps> Anybody in here got anything for me? I'm looking for work, I'm looking for work. Don't fret over the gloom. Yeah. There's nothing to oh. fear. Old Lorbrook will brighten your spirits. Just lend him your ear. Until next time. Uh, okay. I totally listened to There ain't much that. to offer, but if you want a place dry to spend the night... Here. Take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Oh, All right, then. I do not like killing giants. They're kind of big. And kind of mean. But they are kind of peace-loving, too. So, you know, that's kind of a, just a conundrum, really. This flows... How? Oh, wait, aren't I supposed to collect some of this? Yep. Giant lichen. Why not? They say Ulfric Stormcloak murdered the high. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know what they say, I just don't care. Do 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 uh I'm looking for... Oh. This is probably the barracks, right? Yeah. Okay. Looking for that museum that you always hear about whenever you're traveling. That sounds vaguely familiar. Not really. Yes, thank you, phone. That's my it's twelve thirty alarm. In other words, think about shutting off battlefield. <laughs> then You've don't been a good friend to me. Alright, whatever. Something. Let's just go do those quests that were suggested to us then. Uh map, map. What's the map key? Oh duh. You have to select map. Alrighty then, Mr. Giant. Where are you? Talking stone camp. I don't have a teleport that's close. Other than talking stone camp. And I don't want to teleport. Ow, oh, what the hell. This is going to be the death of me. But oh well. that weapon out. Won't do no damage.
brain shot. We good here? We good here? We good here? Excellent. Hello? Oof, bad luck. Bad luck indeed. What should we do now? Well, I do have another bounty here someplace. Well, let me check my quests. So, yeah, kill the bandit leader located at Rift Watchtower. Where's that? The rift is... Where's the rift? Let's click the bunny from as Feel like this is the rift. Where's that watchtower? Normally it gives you an indicator. seen one and that's the bounty from Ash for one. Weird. Because <clears throat> I think I've I almost think I've been to nearly every place in Skyrim. Because I know where I am most of the time just by wandering around the terrain. So, I think we're going to have to continue with the main quest this episode. Because otherwise... You business with the Stop! I do what I can to see... The Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here's your reward. 100 gold. Thank you. I'll take my leave then. Well, look at you. If only everyone acted like you did. All right then. I can't tell if that was sarcasm or not. It's a fine day with you around. Too many bother my wife with their pet I'm problems. I'm married, thank you very much. And if that shocked you, go check out episode 50 of Skyrim. Y you probably won't regret it, because I do terrible acting. It's not even acting, it's literally just speaking whatever came into my head at that moment that sounded funny. And then half the time it wasn't even funny. Yay. Alright then. Well, I can't find this rift watchtower or whatever. That was my plan B. So, plan C it is. We haven't done a main story mission in a while. And which one was it? I think it was this one. That off. All right, that way. Teleport over to Kynes Grove. I hate fast traveling directly to my location because half the time you spawn in right in the middle of a giant clusterfuck. <laughs> Word of warning, there will be swearing. Chicken. I hear screams. No! You don't want to go up there! A dragon! It's attacking! Ah. Well, I don't know. Not... I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not waiting around to find out. I am. Or... It... it... We gotta find some place to hide. Come on. Come on. Hurry, we might be too late. Where? Oh shit. The fuck? Do things just spawn in and die? Well, there you are. I 
I was coming up that hill, I was like, hey, wait a minute, I hear voices. And they don't sound human. Oh, it's dragons shouting at each other. No, just one dragon shouting at the earth or land or river thing happens to be in the way. Yes, I did just randomly punch a fox. Why? Because I felt like it. It's a fire dragon. And it's pissed. Alduin. No damage. That's Alduin. There's no point trying to attack him. Hello, Bone Dragon. Coming down, all right. It's to be a real fight, then. Good. Stay down. Dragonborn. Bloody long to figure it out. Despite the fact he was supposedly watching me. If I could make air quotes more obvious, I would. Uh, do I have enough? I'm just. Thanks to the dragon soul, sucker. Alright, word of the wise, don't bother shooting Alduin. Are dragon That's what these are. These are dragon burial mounds. They're all over bloody Skyrim. Oh shit! That's a lot of dragons. I owe, I owe you some answers, don't I? Maybe. Go ahead. Whatever you want to know. I'm one of the last. Eh. A very long time ago, the blades yeah. were dragon blades, slayers. Dragon slayers. For the blah, last two hundred years. years since the last dragon blades are searching for now purpose. The dragons, dragons are coming back. back. The purpose is clear again. Clear. Blah 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 blah. Not blah 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 blah. Really? Where? Oh. Interesting. Damn it! We're blundering around in the dark here. We need to figure. Exactly. We used to be known across town for the last yeah, two, yeah, yeah. but we never found one. Okay, can I become the a blade now? We needed the I know that's possible. Our best lead. Or maybe it's after this. But they aren't involved. Okay. The faction that rules. There's no worse enemy to humankind in Tamriel. The Empire barely survived yeah, the last okay. war. Okay, we think somewhere are bringing the dragon back. Nothing solid yet. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? Before the Great War, our Grand Ma So we fought them yep, in the shadows. Boring. All across. If we could get into the... Problem is, that place is locked up tighter than a miser's... Hmm, I'm not sure yet. Meet me back in Riverwood. If keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. Mm-hmm. What do you need, Dragonborn? Why well, didn't it double equip? Thank you. Ah, sealed in. Okay, at least his tail stopped shaking. No, but these sights are all over Skyrim. And that could be worrisome. Rephrase, that is worrisome.
Hmm. Okay. Meet me back in Riverwood. Jeez, you gonna run that distance? Of course I could do that, but I mean run? Fast travel, come on. New age. Get with it. And that mug is nothing in it. That's great. <laughs> I'm all out of hot chocolate now. Poor Alvar. She just walked over her husband's corpse. At least I think it was her husband. I can't remember who was married to who. Nah, completely slipping my mind. I don't think this you were is following. a local favorite. Come on, one I of the first plan. songs I ever learned. Ragnar what are you staring at? Shut up. Feindal thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine. I keep telling him. Camilla Valerius knows I'm... I've seen him sneaking over to the Riverwood Trader to speak with her when I'm not around. He's wasting his time. Is that sarcasm? I... Uh, still, you have a point. Camilla... Here, let me give you a particularly venomous letter. Say it's from Fendel. That should get Camilla to stop inviting the elf over. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ethical conundrum time. If I do give What's Her Face the letter, then it gives this possibly jealous man and narcissistic by the sound of it, well, the inn. If I don't. Well, in this case, I'm probably going to defer to something Johnny Depp said. I think it was Johnny Depp. I don't know. It might have been. I was on a. I was on a famous quote website, and it might have been Johnny Depp. It might have been someone else. But they said that um, if you love two people, choose the second, because there must be something better you love in the second that made you fall out of love, or at least oh, love another yeah. than from the first. I'm butchering that quote, by the way, but I think you might get the purpose. I wish this was soundproof. But then he went quiet, did Ragnar the Red, when he met the shield maiden Matilda. I figured out how we're going to get you into the Thalmor Embassy. That would be a bad idea. I'd be too likely to attract the wrong kind of... The Thalmor Ambassador, Ellen Lund. I can get you into one of those parties. Once you're inside the Embassy, you can get... I have a contact inside the Embassy. His name is Malborn. Wood Elf. Plenty of... I'll get word for him to meet you in solitude at the Winky... While you're doing that, I'll work on getting you... Meet me at the Solitude Stables after you've arranged things with Melbourne. Any questions? Don't worry about Melbourne. He's not a danger... He's a wood elf. Luckily, they don't know who he really is, or he wouldn't be serving drinks at the Ambassador's party. Let me handle that. You'll have a real invitation, don't worry. As long as you can act the part of a Thalmor toady, you'll get past the guards. That's when the fun starts. You'll have to slip away from the party without raising the alarm. Then you'll need to find Ellen Wynn's office and search her files. Melbourne should be able to point you in the right direction. Sounds good. Be careful. Yeah, okay. Notice this sword. Weird. Ah, Orcish Greatsword. That's why. What? Something you're still confused about? Close some doors, lady. We're the Secret Blade Society. How have you remained secret? We've left every single door we've ever opened open. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. Alright. A whole bunch of fast traveling. That's what the story quests seem to be nowadays. Ah, there it is. Hidden behind the frap symbol up in the top corner that you guys can't see. <laughs> Damn, Queen Patima. Or Patema, Patip, whatever, that name. You are crazy evil. And 
As usual, every single man in the entire village leaves the bar. And so do some women. Why would you call your establishment the Winking Skeever? It sounds like the Winking Cadaver or something like that. Either way, it doesn't sound good. This is an ode to Skyrim's staunch protectors, the Imperials. Oh, fuck. Hmm? Really? Yo- Here's the deal. I can smuggle some equipment into the Embassy for- Don't plan on bringing anything else in with you. Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the Embassy. You're asking me? If you actually want to get out alive, I'd bring whatever you need to move quietly and kill quickly. Let's do it! Okay, I'll get this inside the embassy for you. I've gotta go. I'll find you at the party. Don't worry. Uh, I'm hesitant giving him any of my stuff. Oh, I'm still wearing that. Wow! Okay. Um, give him the mail. I still got that on me, too. <laughs> I guess I haven't cleaned up since, um... Ooh, I'm gonna be naked by the time I stop. Oh, that's my ring. Nice. Um, and take that, too. Okay, I am currently probably naked. Uh, health potions? No. No. Nope. Nope. Anything in here? Nope. 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 Nothing here. Why do I have ebony ore on me? I need to clean up my inventory. A whole bunch of random crap in here. I can still got the ruby dragon claw. Yeesh. Sapphires and pelts and shit. Down with the yeah, Rick the clothes. Killer. Priority number one. Uh, items, apparel. Uh. Clothes I got. Yeah, uh, he's dead. Yeah, that. Uh. King. On the day of your death, we will drink and we'll sing. Barefoot in armor. Why not? We're the children of Skyrim and we fight all our lives. And when Southern Guard beckons, every one of us dies. But this land. This is gonna be fun. Probably fast travel to White Run. Yeah, and then I'll drop off a whole bunch of stuff, um, get some rudimentary equipment to get there and survive long enough, and then and then we'll play it from there. But I gotta get rid I gotta get rid of all the crap I got in my inventory. So. I'll be back in just yes. a second. Oh, this is gonna be good. See that dragon over there? There he is. And these are Thalmor Justicars. So far, they've killed everything that's ever crossed their path. Almost me. 
But luckily, I'm wearing my full robes of the Dark Brotherhood, so I was able to control Crouch and got away rather quickly. But I'm curious to see what will happen when they hit the dragon. Because evidently someone's already over there. And I'm hesitant to attack the dragon myself, because like I said, I'm not I don't I'm wearing my Dark Brotherhood stuff and I've given all my good stuff to that one guy who's gonna sneak all the crap in. This guy looks suspiciously like Alduin. But I know he's not. I'm just going to stay handsomely out of the way and watch what happens when NPC collides with Dragon. Concerned, completely unconcerned. It is Alduin. And he's summoning another dragon. Oh shit! I don't have a bow or anything. I certainly hope these Dalmor help. Because this fight is going to go fast. Probably not in my favor, either. Did we scare him off before it was gonna happen? of it. Well, it was Alduin. I just don't think it's that time for the dragon, for that dragon in particular, to be summoned. For some reason, the animation's already been started. Weird. No one's gonna investigate this, this giant soul pillar in the middle of nowhere. No? Alright, well, we're off to meet Delphine, whatever, and I stayed with that Dragon Pillar soul thing for a minute or two to see if anything would happen, and nothing did, but when I tried to fast travel, it said that enemies were near, so it leads me to believe that the enemy code had been spawned in, but something happened to disrupt it, like maybe a game value. Maybe a boolean said false, and then it didn't Have you given Malborn the gear you want to smuggle into the embassy? I did. Good. But the only way you're going to get past the guards is... Which means you need to look the part. When you're ready, I'll keep the rest of your gear safe until you get back. You'll only have what Melbourne smuggled in for you, plus whatever you can pick. You can't go to a party at the Thalmor Embassy dressed like that. Alright, well, let me just stick it on then. What'd you give me? Party boots, party clothes... Arm to the teeth? Is there a party sword? No, I guess not. Ah, still got my cowl on, hold on. Let me just de equip every other bit of stuff on me. Can't go to a party at the Thalmor Embassy dressed like that. I'm in the party clothes. I guess that will have to do. You should pass for a real guest. At Ready to board the carriage to the embassy? Don't worry. It just make sure. Good luck. Uh, all the quests are gonna update. Because <laughs> I've lost all my inventory. <laughs>